So many of you are familiar with this radio, very popular ham radio called the Baofeng UV5R. There are big pluses and minuses of this radio, and I'm going to tell you how we can solve some of them. Number one is the plus of this radio. It's 26 US dollars. Pretty hard to beat, right? for a ham radio. It is pretty sturdy, despite what you might read online, I have found my radios to be very sturdy indeed. Now, the downside of this ham radio, which does require a license, by the way, is that it's very notorious for generating spurious emissions, which means that if you transmit frequency mode, on, for example, the national calling frequency. This radio has been found to generate additional transmissions on adjacent frequencies. These are called spurious emissions. Sometimes they're called harmonics, but harmonics go only upwards and spurious emissions go both directions. So this radio does in fact create spurious emissions. Why is this bad? Well, number one, you could interrupt other people's transmissions, but additionally, you could transmit outside of the legal ham band. For example, you might interfere with aircraft or some emergency services. So what is my suggestion? Get this model radio. It's the Baofeng GT5R. Not only do I recommend getting this model, but I recommend checking out the vendor in my link tree where I bought mine because they are a reputable dealer of Baofeng. So you're not gonna wind up with some fake product. Now, why is this better? Well, the manufacturer has solved the issue of the spurious emissions. This has been proven uh, by people like Dave Kassler on YouTube. I've done a video on that as well, where this radio has been run through a spectral analyzer and has been proven in fact to have spectral purity, far superior to the Baofeng UV5R. Additionally, this radio ships, or is supposed to ship, gated to the amateur radio ham bands. Now this is great for a new ham who is scared they might transmit outside of a legal ham band. Well, here's the thing. I got my radio and I was very excitedly making a video on how this does not transmit outside legal ham frequencies when I discovered the radio was unlocked. So I got in touch with the uh, vendor who was tremendously helpful and I found out if your Baofeng arrives, unlocked and you're a new ham and you want to make sure that you can't possibly transmit outside of the ham bands here's what you do you turn the radio off you press ptt and the number five and then you turn the radio on so now we are gated to the amateur radio bands so even if i go one three six Zero, zero, zero. Even if I try to transmit outside of the ham bands, I cannot. Whereas one, four, six, five, two, zero. If I transmit on a legal ham band and frequency, I can. November Whiskey Six Sierra radio check. There we go. Now let's say you're a more advanced ham and for whatever reason not to commit anything that is illegal you want to reverse this to the unlocked position it's the same as many other videos that have been put out already uh, on how you unlock the uv5r the sister radio and that is the awkward function of holding down ptt money the monitor button vfo and turning the radio on. And now we have done a factory reset on our um, GT5R. This functionality only works on this radio. And I think it is a fantastic feature to have that you can gate your radio to legal ham frequencies. Um, so thanks for watching and uh, we'll see you next time. This is Glam Ham.